Hey everyone, this is Amanda Cook here, and I have another great product from Inno. And if you follow me, you know that I really like Inno's products. Here is your surprise. Hmm, white box. What could it be? But anyway, I love Inno's products. I've never gotten anything bad from Inno. Um, they have some pretty awesome stuff. They've got everything. They've got diffusers. They've got lighting. So, hmm, wonder what this one is now. It wasn't a styrofoam box, but look, now the box is empty, so you know. I'm not going to drop anything out. Okay, here's your next clue. There's a steak to it. Now, let me tell you just a little bit about this steak first before I go into everything else. Now, it is, I brought my handy dandy ruler this time for this video. So, it is almost seven and three quarter inches long, right at about seven and three quarter inches long. And... These are very heavy duty, okay? These are not ones that you, I mean, look, I'm white knuckling this here. And it is not bending, it is not breaking. Their stuff is very strong. It has a nice point on it, so when you're sticking this item into the ground, you don't have to worry about it. You can basically take it and stab it in. If you've got harder ground, it does work better, of course. You know, if you soften the ground first, pour you a little bit of water on, make sure it seeps in, then try to do it. You've got, it's heavy duty here. They didn't cheap. They didn't go cheap on this part. This is very strong, very durable. It's not going to twist. Look, okay, this is me trying to twist it. Now, okay, again, I'm not too strong, but I'm trying it here to, to show you guys that it is not really bending. But now here's what the item is. Ta-da! I know you're excited. I'm excited. I love loving those products. It is an LED it's an LED two-in-one solar-powered light. Now, you can see this part right here was a part. Not a big deal. All you do is just snap it back together. I say that. I'm just going to snap it back together here. In a moment. And it's hard to do because, of course, I have the camera on me. But it does. It just goes right back in together. There's no problem at all with it. Now, it is probably not going to show you much due to the fact that it hasn't been out. Um... But here is your, it's a very large solar panel. It is, the actual panel itself is about five and a quarter. And the full length of the whole thing is just a wee bit over five and a half. So if you see there, and I was measuring when I said the, the panel size, I was measuring from right here to right here. Now it does have a protective coating over the top of it. You can probably peel that off. It's just to help you in shipping. And I'm gonna see if I can't get this to, to sit on there a little bit better. I believe I, I need the screw and I haven't opened the little baggie. It does come with a little bag of screws. So you've got all your screws. You can anchor it if you want to attach it. So you've got three screw holes in the bottom there. Yeah, here's that piece I need. So it comes apart, but this little dude where it looks like a little cat hat, that's the one that she, uh, there are directions. I just, if you watch me, you know I refuse to read directions because half the world doesn't read directions. So I'm going to show you the way that you're going to wind up opening the box up and not reading directions. I want you to see how big this light is. I'm trying to do it so you can see it without seeing. But look how big. You've got four huge LED lights. Now let's measure. The actual light part itself is just about two and a half. So that's how I'm measuring it. It's about two and a half. And then the full overall is almost three and a half. So that part is huge. Then what you do, if you don't want to screw it, so you could screw it to anything that you wanted to, have it like that. And then this is fully adjustable. It was adjustable. I have now since screwed and tightened it up. But it's fully adjustable. This part's adjustable. See? And then you tighten another of the little cat hat pieces here. Tighten it down so it'll stay where you want it to stay. Or you want to show off those right now it's almost Halloween here so if you want to show off Halloween decorations or your Christmas decorations or hey you want to just show off how in the world you're going to walk up to your front steps then you've got the steak to be able to do that and again this steak is a very heavy duty steak so you're you're all good there um these lights are absolutely awesome um one day I'll have it to where you can actually see it oh and oh the cooler part oh my gosh didn't even see this till now it has a button. Now, I know it's probably gonna be hard to see exactly what the writing on here says, but it says off, high, and low. So, you would just, yeah, you would press it. Oh, there's the light, look. Ah. Let's see if I can get it to stay on. 
Did you hear it click? Probably hear octants in the background. Um, so the light is, it's already charged up when you get it. Yay! So you can go ahead and start having your fun and don't have to worry about it being charged. That you have the button and why the button is so cool, which again, I just didn't notice it until now. But the button is so cool because what happens? Sometimes you don't necessarily, like if you're gone, you don't want to have to take your light up. You can just turn your light off now. You don't have to worry about it. Yay! So how awesome is that? I've actually not seen that before in a solar light. So, you know, you are totally cool. So, here is your two-in-one LED light. And it has 200, um, I know I'm going to say this wrong lumens so in other words it's really really bright but you can put it on the wall you can put it in the ground you can put it anywhere that you want to and it's the light thanks guys